Welcome to NTI 2020. My name is Ms. Zender. I am so excited to be back and I am ready to teach PE and health. So let's get started. Good afternoon, Carter Cubs. My name is Ms. McCullough. I'm going to be your art teacher this year and I wanted to tell you a little bit about me. I have been at Carter for going on seven years. I have taught art for five years. I taught fourth grade for one year. And then I also taught computer along with art for a few years. I think it was three years. So I'm really excited to see you all log on on August 25th. Some fun things we're gonna do is read stories and then do a project that's based on that story. We're gonna learn to some painting techniques, some drawing skills, different things like that. Um, more will definitely be coming as the weeks go by. Um, I want to tell you a little bit about my family and what I like to do when I'm not working um, at Carter. I just got married last summer. My husband's name is Josh, so we've been married for one year. Um, he's at work right now, so I can't show you his face. I also have three dogs, and I'll try to find them right now if I can. So hold on one second. All right, everybody. Say hi to Dart. He's a two-year-old pit bull. He's mixed with Sharpe, and we got him when he was a baby at the Kentucky Humane Society. He loves me being home during NTI. Look, he's getting excited to meet you all. His tail's wagging. And this is my Libby girl. She is a nine-year-old beagle lab mix. I got her at the New Albany animal shelter when she was about three years old so I've had her for about five years she's pretty much been in this position all day just kind of napping on the couch when she's not sleeping she keeps our yard free of squirrels and rabbits and she definitely uses that beagle nose and last but not least here's our senior citizen this is Maverick he's a Shih Tzu um, my husband rescued him when he was six months old he was a little street scrappy pup. So he actually has an injured eye from his time on the street, but he's still as playful as a puppy when he is awake. Um, he's 11 years old, I think. And um, yeah, he pretty much sleeps all day and then he comes alive at night for his tennis balls and his evening, I can't say it out loud because then they'll want to go, his evening W-A-L-K. That's all my dogs. So some other things about me that you might want to know, you, especially those of you who haven't met me before, some things I like to do outside of teaching art. Um, I like doing my pure bar workouts, which, is, um, which I've been doing from home because of coronavirus. I also have really gotten into plants this summer now that I have more time to take care of them. So I have gathered quite a collection once we get back into the classroom i can't wait to assign one of you all to be my gardener who gets to water the plants during the week um, i've been growing a vegetable garden i've been doing a lot of puzzles working from home and a lot of reading so things like that um, i'm really looking forward to getting to know each and every one of you and i can't wait to see you at the end of the month bye Oh, hello there. My name is Mr. Coltis, and uh, you just caught me and my friend Venus here listening to the great Duke Ellington. It's one of my very favorite things to do, and uh, here at the house, often my wife Amy and I and Venus will sit and listen to a whole album of music and just, just love it. You know, I gotta say, I'm very excited. Very excited because even though this is my 12th year teaching, this is the very first year I get to teach one of my favorite things in the world, and that is music. We're going to learn so much about music this year. We're going to learn how to sing music, how to play musical instruments, how to read music, and how to write music as well. We're going to learn how the orchestra has different instruments in it, what they're called. We're going to learn how composers arrange music all kinds of good stuff, but most importantly, we're gonna have fun. It's the most important thing about music. 
it can provide a lifetime of enjoyment and it can be so much fun and that is my goal for us this year for sure i can't wait to see you all in my virtual music classroom very soon so with that i'm gonna get back to my music venus here is gonna get back to it too see you all soon hi car cubs and families my name is Carrie Kartzinger and I'll be teaching computer lab this year. I have been at Carter since 2002 where I started off as a fifth grade teacher. After a few years, I became the computer lab teacher and then I've been second grade for the past about five years or so. And now I'm back in the computer lab and so excited. I've been married to my husband, Mike, since 2001. We have three wonderful children, a junior, Elizabeth, who goes to Mail, a sophomore, Caitlin, who also goes to Mail, and a sixth grader, Michael, who goes to Know. My hobbies are pretty much watching all of my children play sports because they're into big, they're big time into sports. Uh, volleyball, watching volleyball is our biggest thing. And that's pretty much all I do. I do love to read and watch volleyball, watch basketball. I look forward to this year getting to know all of you. Hi there. My name is Mrs. Stewart and I am your librarian at Carter Traditional Elementary School. I'm so excited to be back this year to see the students that we've had in the past and to meet any new students who are coming to us this year. Um, this is my second year at Carter, but it's actually my 18th year as a librarian in Jefferson County Public Schools. That makes me feel a little bit old, <laughs> um, but I love my job and I love being part of the Carter family. Um, in addition to being your school librarian, um, I have a family. I have a husband and two daughters. My daughters are in kindergarten and second grade. We also have a dog named Copper. Um, as a family, we enjoy being together, uh, playing board games, playing outside, going to parks and going for walks, um, watching movies as a family. Um, I enjoy lots of movies. Um, on my own or with my husband as well. Um, of course, I love reading, um, reading on my own, reading to my kids, with my kids, listening to audiobooks when I drive, um, reading all around. Um, other things I enjoy, um, I also like making jewelry and some crafts and a little bit of baking, um, writing. So, Probably not too far from what you might expect from a librarian. <laughs> um, nothing too crazy. I'm not out skydiving or anything like that. Um, but I'm really excited to work with you this year in library. We will, of course, read and talk about lots of great books, information, and fiction. Um, we will hopefully engage in some really interesting projects, especially projects driven by maybe some of your choices and some of your interests, um, using technology, um, hopefully creating and making, especially once we're back in the library and we can do some of that. Um, just be ready this year to ask questions. To me, that's what the library is all about, is exploration. So I'll be ready to explore topics that are interesting to you, topics you're learning about in class and you need or want to know more about something you hear or see on the radio or in the news or wherever, and you just are like, hmm, want to know about that. Um, so be ready to explore together um, this year as part of our library class. I look forward to teaching you and seeing you on the computer, and then hopefully before too long in person. Um, enjoy the last few days of your summer, and I will see you soon.